Hello, my name is Sean. This is in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to manipulate combo boxes by using Visual Basics. To get started, let's go cre and create a new project. This project will be Visual Basic Project and Windows Form App. I'm just going to name that my project appropriately, my combo box, CMB. And I'm just going to click OK. I'm going to reduce the size slightly on my form. And for this project, I need two buttons. Let's delete that one. Let's increase the size. I'm just going to hold the control key down and just replicate this button here. OK, two buttons. I need a combo box. And I need a text box. size right so here I'm just going to type the text value will be add fruit and the text value here will be remove fruit so as you guessed I'm just going to add fruits in this combo box by actually using this text box. I'm going to name this combo box appropriately. So I'm going to go to that name value. And instead of combo box, I'm just going to call it CMB uh, fruits. And here I'm going to call this text box TXT fruits. OK. Now I'm going to double click on my add fruit button and what I need to do is call the uh, CMD, the combo box fruits, and then I will say dot items and then I will say, let's double click on the items here and then I will say dot add and then I will specify how I'm going to add the items. I'm going to say txt fruits, which is a text field, so I'm going to just type type dot text. I'm going to copy this command because this command will be similar to the remove command. I'm going to go back to the design view because I need to generate the private sub. So I'm going to double click now on the remove uh, fruit, paste this line of code and instead of add, I'm just going to type here remove. And that's the only difference. OK, let's test the project. As you can see here, the combo box has no data, no content. I'm going to type here uh, orange, oranges, click add. I'm going to type here apples, click add. I'm going to type here pears, add. And now if I drop down the list, I've got oranges, apples, and pears. If I would like to remove the oranges, I'm just going to type here oranges, select remove, and oranges are no longer exist on my list. So that's how, you, how easy it is to add content into a combo box or remove con content from a combo box. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next tutorial.